There's a prophet who is claiming that he saw the death of Shona Ferguson. As much as this is too fresh in the wounds of, of many who loved the a actor and the producer and the director who was married to Connie Ferguson, my condolences to the family. But the issue here is that did this guy prophesy about the death of Shona Ferguson? That is the question. And I'm going to answer it here and look at the prospects. Was this just a mere prediction? Was this just um, an understanding that somebody is in the ICU? Probably they might not make it. Let's take a look. He makes a prediction four days ago. Four days ago, there was an article and it was all over social media. Everyone, you know, even me, when I checked on Twitter, it was there. People were talking about Shona Ferguson. So it is very, very apparent that if anyone gets into ICU, chances are that they might not make it a number of people like we look at the likes of um, nelson mandela when he went into icu he did not stay long after that and what is also even shocking about this prophecy is that it was just posted on facebook one there was no re revelation of the name number two it was not specified the dates and the times so it is it it it, um, it just becomes an assumption not a prediction I know people might say why, but he once predicted some things that happened. My guy, you need to predict some things with a bit of more details. And those details will actually assist us to be able to ascertain whether what you are saying is true or it's not. So those are the things that I wanted you to look at. That Go and check out his page and see the prophet does not have much detail. And it leaves a lot, of, a lot to be desired. When you say South African actor, I saw him in the in the ICU, but we actually see that the issue of him being in ICU was there on the article. This article was written about three days, I mean four days ago, and as you can see, it is actually stating that Shona Ferguson was in ICU, right? So if you then make a prophecy based on that four days ago. I would have believed the guy if he had prophesied this maybe two months ago and say I see an, act, an actor in the ICU. Not to make a prediction based on the information that is actually available in the public domain for everyone to see. And everyone was praying for, for Shona Ferguson uh, to be exact. So for me, it's just a mere prediction. If he wants to seek relevance and say he prophesied about the death of uh, Shona Ferguson, I don't think it is good for us to give him that credit. But tell me what you think in the comment section. Do you think that he prophesied? But I think that he is just somebody who took chances and he wants to make sure that he brings his name forward by saying things that were going to happen. Uh, and it's for me, it's just a mere prediction. It's not... A prophecy it's just a mere prediction somebody just saying that um i'm seeing him act the worst part about it is that the the this it was known everyone from everyone that the man was in icu so definitely if one is in icu they are always always going to be having machines around them and those machines um we all know the beeping sound that they make ding, 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 ding. and you are telling us four days ago when the article is already there and we know that the ICU, this is what happens in the ICU. And then you come to us and said you prophesied about it. And now we are seeing this news that he died of COVID-19. You did not even mention that. I would understand if he had said, okay, I see an act actor who is in the ICU. COVID-19 or something like that, just to hint, then I would say, okay, maybe he was seeing. So for me, he, as much as he has predicted about other things, but I think that he missed it on this one. Uh, that's all that I have for you. Uh, I'm going to do another video today and please check out that video in the pinned comments. That's all. That's all. I will see you on the next video. This is your boy once again reminding that Rise Up Africa, the world is waiting for you.